hey what's up everybody so the windows 11 that we are using right now is incomplete many people just hate windows 11 if you ask me do you hate it or love it i don't have a clear answer but i do use windows 11 as my main windows os but i also miss some windows features that are available in other windows but in windows 11 those features are just gone if you don't care about how the windows 11 looks and you don't care about missing features and unwanted features of windows 11 then it's pretty good actually it can do all the things what other windows can do after all windows 11 is the new next gen windows os you love it or hate it it is what it is i'm not gonna go over what are the missing features and unwanted features of windows 11 because the list is huge yeah it's actually gigantic instead in this video i'm gonna talk about the next update of windows 11 which i call it a windows 11 2.0 and actually it is going to be called windows 11 22h2 update windows 11 october or november update windows 11 sun valley 2 update yeah that's a lot of name for just one update and i gave one more name windows 11 2.0 you're welcome microsoft you cannot satisfy each and every one you know i use windows 11 so i want windows 11 to be better I want some of the Windows features that are missing in Windows 11 back. So this next update of Windows 11 is actually going to make Windows 11 a lot better if you are using Windows 11. So let me show you some of the good features in Windows 11 2.2 update which will make Windows 11 better. So let's begin. So the next major update of Windows 11 is actually going to be a huge update because there are going to be a lots of new changes, new features, and overall many, many improvements. In this update, we will have a better start menu. Now we will be able to create a folders where we can stack our applications, games, and we can organize our games and applications in folders. This is like the best feature coming in Windows 11 start menu. And of course, you will be able to do a drag and drop to the taskbar. Yes, it is a feature that was gone in Windows 11, but now with this update, it will be back. I'm really happy to see this feature back in Windows 11. Also, in this update, we will have a dedicated notification panel, which will stay here even if you don't have a notifications. If you compare it with the current version of Windows 11, you can see in my main Windows 11, there is no notifications, so there is no notification panel. But in this update, we have the dedicated notification panel and there is a do not disturb mode which is a rebranded of focus assist so you can turn do not disturb from notification panel even if there are no notifications the notification panel will still stay there so we can easily access the do not disturb mode and with this update we will also get a new task manager which will match the design of windows 11 and with this update we will get a brand new feature called live captions so using this feature you will be able to see captions on your windows 11 from any audio video you play on your windows 11 pc so you can see for the example i'm playing my video on youtube and there is the live caption running here so we can also customize this so this feature is actually pretty good it is a brand new feature but it is a pretty good feature too. So these are some of the big features coming to Windows 11 in next major update of Windows 11, which I call it a Windows 11 2.0 because it is the first major update of Windows 11 after its release. So actually it is going to be a Windows 11 version 22H2. Now maybe you are excited to get this update. So this update is going to be available in 2022, October or November. Yeah, it's going to take a few more months. But the good thing is that you can actually try this new version of Windows 11 by joining the Windows Insider program. 
and uh, just like I did okay but if you don't want to join a Windows Insider program there is a way to get a Windows 11 22 H2 ISO file and you can see all the features you can use it you can do whatever you want so if you want me to make a tutorial on how to get a Windows 11 22 H2 ISO file then do the comment I'll do it yeah so that's it hope you enjoyed it I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.